Hi friends, welcome to another session of uh, tactics. In this session, I'm gonna show you uh, a quick idea about a DC to DC step up module which converts a 5 volt to uh, almost 16 volt, typically for a 5 volt and 12 volt application, and it is giving uh, a power of 8 watt. So, this is something what I'm talking about. It's a very tiny DC DC converter step up module. Uh, I got it from eBay for uh, almost uh, one dollar and the brand uh, I don't think there is a brand but it's uh, written as SDXMDZ DC DC boost module start voltage is DC 1 volt input is DC 2 volt to 6 volt output is DC 5 to 16 volt and max output is 8 watt so that's something it looks like I got one with a screw terminal already soldered that one I got one screw terminal which is 5 mm or 0.5 centimeters and this is how I use it for the output for this new one just put it in the hole already made that one and solder the positive and negative terminal at below on this side on the other side we are going to uh, install a small USB, uh, USB connector which I'm gonna salvage from an old damaged USB thumb drive I'm gonna desolder it from this uh, module so that I require soldering gun and a desoldering pump. The pump looks like this one. So let's start with this one first. First I'm gonna show you from what pins you have to desolder. There are two support on on either side of this connectors. One is here below and one is on the other side. Apart from that, there is there are four terminals that you have to carefully desolder and disconnect from the module. Maybe you can see it if I focus my camera. Yeah, so these are four terminals for the connection uh, in for the internal connection and the support are this one support from here and another from this one, this one from the both of the sides so we're gonna desolder this both side first and then we're gonna sort desolder these connections so that this part of the connector will be separated from this all module You have to be careful about this one. You need a small amount of patience for the tiny parts to get disconnected from its original parts. Alright friends, I got it separated from this module and I fast forwarded the step because it was taking a little time and a small amount of patience of course. So this is how it looks like now. Then we just salvage from this module. And let me show you quickly about the polarities. Now if you hold this terminal like this, from, from your right, the first one is plus VCC, what is that is 5 volt, and middle two are quickly besides the plus 5 volt, it is D plus, data plus, after that data minus, and at the last is a ground. So in this case, we are going to use only plus 5 from the right side, and from the left leftmost is ground. All right. So this uh, model we have now, which is the terminal is soldered already. 
and it's going to if, if you see if you see uh, carefully on this module you can see there is already polarities for the input from here from the right and from the left so if you see down from your right is plus plus uh, polarity and on your left is minus so you're gonna connect this connector like this this is how it's going to fix we have two holes for the supports and in the middle we have four terminals for the connections so this two for the support will connect from the uh, on the terminals like this then we have to go uh, we, uh, we are going to solder this four terminals across with along with two support terminals also I'll fast forward this step also and uh, I'll come to you at the end after I solder this uh, 4 and 6 to lock 6 terminals together to show you how it, how it looks like alright friends so this is how I finish uh, the soldering of this uh, module I will show you a close look of this one this is how it looks like now I have soldered mainly carefully both the ends uh, of both the corners and I have also carefully soldered the support terminals here and here so now this module looks like something like this this part is our input from where we, we can now disconnect directly to uh, any USB port from where we can get 5 volt and of course this one will provide you a 12 volt output from here 12 to 16 volt so this was the session especially for the introduction of this module in next session I'm going to show you how to use this module and how to uh, use it for uh, different applications I hope you have liked this video and uh, if you like this video kindly give me a thumbs up and if you have not subscribe it please subscribe it and uh, please tune in for our next video till then goodbye take care